Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Judy. And I'm King, how you doing? And we're the Olaunis. Back again. We're back again. We're in the fourth week, guys. Can you believe it? Episode it's 19. Episode 19. Episode 19. We're in the fourth week. Guys, I really can't wait for Castle more because these guys really be giving me the ick. Firstly, I want to talk about Dabby and India. Okay, I love, 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 love Dabby and India together. But why is Dabby in women business? Dabby, you're doing a bit too much, man. It's not even Dabby's fault, that's the thing. It's actually not Dabby's fault. It's the Islanders' fault. They're all going to King is behind the camera today because our daughter is cranky, so she's a daddy's girl, so obviously he has to work his magic. But yeah, she's not letting him go. This is what you have to do, you have to start showing your husband at some point. You're gonna be hearing King in the background, just like adding whatever he needs to add to this. I know it's throughout today's show, it's Dami, it's Dami, yeah, it's Dami. We're going, going to him because he's the one that has got the time. Everyone we got yeah. doing that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's really, he's really chatty, you see now. Yeah, he's really chatty, he's probably really, listening to them, crossing his legs, listening to them, yeah. doing this, do, doing this, and this. He's always one that sometimes, even he's one, he's one in the shit in the conversation. Yeah. Let's talk about the whole situation with Ekinsu, um, Ekinsu, Gemma, Luca, and Dami. So, in today's episode, Dami decided to do predictions for everyone. So, he predicted that Ekinsu still likes <laughs> the Dami the psychic. I know, Dami the psychic boy. He predicted that Ekinsu still likes the video. And if there was a chance, she'll go back there. And she's really wondering if she could, if she should go back there. Um, and then he predicted that. Um, Gemma, Gemma um, doesn't really like, she likes Luca, she's happy with him right now, however, if a new guy was to walk in that was 100% her type and had Luca's chat, she would go for it. And she said, she basically said that she agrees, like, it's not far off. Then Ekin Sue takes her big mouth straight, I don't even know if it's because of the editing, I don't know what happened, but it looked like she went straight to... <clears throat> um, Luca's boyfriend, Jax. What's wrong with Ekinsu? Sorry, like, what's wrong with what is that? I don't know. So she went straight to um, to Jax and um, Jax and Paige, and literally was like she twisted it a bit. Like she didn't say everything else that was said within that conversation. She just said, "Oh, basically, pa um, Gemma said that if someone if um, agreed that if someone else comes in, that there's a possibility of a head turning." Which was really taken out of context. Like I could see how much taken out of context it is. And to be honest, so th that whole palaver happened. What do you guys think about it? Because I feel like um, there's nothing wrong with that. Like with what, with what she said. No, no, no. So I feel like Ekinsu was definitely wrong about the whole how she went about the whole situation. She's just trying to start drama. Yeah, She's it it's always something to do with Ekinsu. I I feel like at this point the girl's on well. She's actually on well. <laughs> but uh, what's it called? Gemma and um, Luca, after a long time, they decided to have the talk of, oh yeah, uh, um, Luca was basically saying that he's 100% into her and that he's obsessed with her. And she's like, we're not boyfriend and girlfriend. So I'm on, I'm on with her on that. Because these guys here, yeah, today in this season of Love Island, they are proper whipped over these girls. Yeah, they're like, they're like possessive. Yeah, they're possessive. Like, it's like, where did, they, where did they find these girls, these guys? Where did they find them? Because all of them. All of that. All of that. Like, I don't understand. They're not your girlfriend. Like, none of you have asked any of them to become girlfriend. Like, well, you've been soppy since week one. I just don't understand. It's just too much. I don't know what it is. And Luca, 100%. I can swear on my life. This guy knows who Gemma's dad is. I think I agree with that. He now. is doing too much. I think and he apparently, knows now. yeah, apparently, did you know that apparently um Remy Remy said that the guys knew from like no he can not said the guys knew from like day three about Oh that dad was always Yeah, that dad was always from day three they knew. Oh so they all acting like they don't know. So they're all acting like they don't know but they knew they knew. So Gemma is probably thinking that it's, it's like you know my, who my dad is. I just chill, man. Yeah, like okay. That's yeah, awesome. like it's just too much. So another person, like thing that happened today was um, the whole um, Paige, Jay, and 
Jacks. and Jacks love triangle. I put this here because Paige is forcing it. She's forcing it. King said today that it seems like she never used to get attention when she was younger. Yeah, I believe so. You know, I think, I think she just started like, you know, when you just blow up suddenly and then you're like, oh yeah. shit, where did this beauty come from? You know, she was a nick when she was a kid. Nah, she still acts like a nick, like seriously. <laughs> because. Hey. Yeah, yeah. So, okay. Yeah, so I just feel like she's forcing it. She was even saying to the girls this morning, like in the morning during Love Island, that. Uh, yeah, like it's a bit of a love triangle. It's a bit lopsided, but it's still a love triangle. No, you wanted to be a love triangle. You know, like in the beginning, no one was interested in Paige. Now she's really forcing this love triangle thing. That's why she kept Jay interested for so long. Or she was acting like she was interested in Jay for so long. Knowing that it wasn't going to go anywhere because she's fully into Jax. She's leading him on. Man. She was leading him, him on. Else and like, that. like even when she was breaking up with him today, because she basically told him that she's not interested, that she's gonna continue with Jack. Even then, she was still like trying to give him loads of eye contact, still trying like do the flirty thing. I'm just like Paige, you're really disappointing me. Like you're really disappointing me. Just stick to the nice girl thing, because this is not it. With Jack's Paige as well. I think Paige wants it to look like Jack likes her more than she likes him. But girl. We know that you've been liking him more than he likes you because I think she could tell that the kind of thing in the in the house right now is the men like the women a lot more, a lot more, and she wants to be part of the clique, part of the gang. But girl, you like him more than he likes you. He's just putting his foot down now like, because he can see another guy is interested. Men do this. Men are just yeah. Anyway, moving on to the next couple, Tasha and Andrew. Throughout today's show, Tasha was thinking about if she wants to f focus 100% on ja on Andrew or if she wants to, you know, explore other options. Tasha, my advice would have been that you should explore other options. You really wanted to get the full Love Island experience and Andrew hasn't let you do that. The only reason why he's stuck on you is because no other ga girl has been interested in him. So that's the only reason why he's stuck on you. If other girls maybe show him a bit of interest, maybe we'll be seeing a different side to Andrew. But literally, all he does is eat, eat cornflakes and yawn. Literally, that's what he does. He's lazy. He can't be bothered to get to know other girls. I'm being really mean to him because King is not here. But yeah, that's my opinion. I just feel like you should have got your Love Island experience because it seems really important to you. And it's a once in a lifetime opportunity for you. So you should have used it to the full opportunity. Like, Seriously, guys, why is it that where is Danica? Where's Danica? I don't even know her name. Danica, Danica, I don't know. Where is she? Where was she on today's episode? I'm looking for my girl. Uh, well, I wasn't looking for her, it was only in the end. I was thinking, has she, has she been kicked out? Okay, King is coming back. Where was Danica today? First of all, hi guys. Um, Danica, yeah, where, where is Danica? Yeah, like she was completely gone. Like not Island one, not like, one scene at all. Not one scene. They were like, "You're boring. Oh, yeah. We're not showing you. You're not getting us no money." Like that's it. Um, that, that, that's kind of mad though. That's maybe, mad. maybe maybe she just maybe she just in a room all day or something. Or, yeah. yeah, and then what's her name? Um, Anti Antigone, I'm even surprised I still remember her name. Antigone. Because this girl was just here for a one week holiday. Like, she's literally here for five days and she's going soon, I can tell. She's actually, yeah, she has nothing to offer. Me. She's got nothing to offer. And let me just talk about Charlie and Jay. Guys, why aren't you looking at Antigone and Danica? I don't understand what happened. Like, why can't you just choose one of them yeah, and just yeah, try and make a love connection? You don't even try to make a love connection I don't to whatsoever. All. Like, what's going on? Is it that new people can't go for new people? Or, I'm really not understanding. No, they don't even try. They don't even try. In so Jay, you're going home soon. I'm, I I wouldn't really care. And then um, Charlie, you can go. <laughs> you can go today. <laughs> no, Charlie. Charlie was just um, a waste of time. Yeah, you can actually go home today. Yeah. Which other which other couples are there? That, what else happened today? So I spoke about Dami and Dami and um, India, um, Paige and Luca, um, Paige and Jax, Luca and Gemma. Yeah. Um, 
You can Gemma. What do you think about Gemma though? How she reacted though? I know you spoke about it, but do you think she, she, she was a bit too much or she could have spoken about it better? No, I felt like she was completely 100%. Like she was reading my mind She's and she was saying up. it. Everyone's fed up with that like, so woman. No, yeah, no, I was even thinking that you were talking about the conversation with Luca. No, 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 no. Yeah, with Ekin too, I feel I really like Gemma. Like, I feel like she's able to stand up for herself. She's able to articulate herself well. And she's 19 years old. Like, seriously. She's very mature for her age. She's very, she can speak very well and stick up very well for her age. Like, at quiet. this point, they just need to go to Casamore. Yeah, because, like, it's Everyone's getting Everyone's all locked up, so there's no one turning their head anymore. The other two girls are not getting picked. The other two guys are forcing to take other people's girls. It's, it's like yeah, what's gonna happen yeah. now? And they are not it. Even the guys are not even scared. That's the worst thing about it. Mm. When Bob shows something and the shell is not bombing, like they're not they're not even scared. They're really not scared. Um, who do you think head is gonna turn on it to Castle more? Okay, right now I feel Jax is gonna turn it big. So King couldn't answer that question completely because Ray I could call it for her dad again. So what um he was just answering what people he thinks are gonna are gonna um turn heads he said Jax I think you know, yeah, yeah, still answer for me, actually. yeah yeah go on I think Jax is gonna turn his head yeah um Jay is looking like he might turn his head Jay's not gonna be here for Castle War okay if he's not there but if he's here, if he is he will yeah Charlie he will definitely turn his head he's not gonna be there if he's not there then cool if he's there he's yeah. turning and um Maybe Andrew might have, he might have temptation, but he's not going to turn his head. David, David, he's definitely going to turn his head. Yeah, David will probably still be Luca, there. Luca, he's, he's about the bag, so he ain't turning yeah, his head. Yeah. That's it. And then for the ladies, oh, Dami, Dami, Dami. Dami's not going to turn his head. He's not going to turn he's his locked. head. Now, for the I ladies. I hope he's not. That would be the shock of the season if Dami turns man. his head. He turns, oh, shit. Dami yeah. is. Now for ladies, yeah, Ekin Sue definitely. Yeah. Tasha definitely. Yeah. Page hundred percent. Yeah. Um Gemma, who depending on who is there. Yeah. Like she said. Yeah. Uh India. India, India, India. It's, uh, she's gonna be really, really she has to be really, really strong. Like, yeah. Of the turn, but yeah. The rest of the girls are definitely turning. All the girls are turning, man. All the girls are turning. Alright guys, so we're just gonna leave it here today because Really don't want us to do this. I'm joking. So anyway, guys, remember to like, share, subscribe, and you know, comment what your opinions are. Have a discussion with us. Yes, We're ready to have discussions you. with you. All right, then. Bye, guys. Royal is just. Bye. Peace. <laughs>